All right, what's going on, you guys? I um, it's SRT Joe, of course. Um, I got so I ended up buying the screen and the. I'm gonna show you guys. This is the media, the media piece for my charger, so I can do a 2021 Apple CarPlay swap on it. I bought this used for about 60 bucks. I got the screen coming. I got a great deal. I couldn't pass up on it. It was seven. It was seven fifty originally. I offered them seven hundred. They accepted the offer, so it came out to like seven sixty shipped. So that should be here tomorrow. So today I'm gonna put this media thing in because this is probably the hardest part about it. So I'm gonna disconnect the battery and um, yeah, and just leave it like. Well, I'm gonna reconnect the battery tonight leave it overnight when i come back tomorrow i'm going to probably gonna take out the dashboard though so i can just swap out the dash real quick and see if the apple carplay works i've been uh trying to do this for a little while now but it's been uh pretty hard to find i don't know what's all this stuff on my car though probably from the car cover oh my keys put this in there all right show you guys this is my old screen right here. It's super slow. That's the only reason. And I had a 17 before this. I had a 2017 Dodge Charger RT. It had Apple CarPlay. Man, I love the Apple CarPlay on that car. It's so beautiful. You don't have to have your phone here. My phone falls out if I drive too fast. I can just have my phone down here. I'll be perfectly fine. Um, look, let's try to go to SRT pages. Look how long it takes. SRT pages. Pages is currently loading. This is literally gonna take like, look. It's gonna take forever. Stuff like it never loads. I have to start driving the car for like five or 10 minutes for it to start loading. But, um, yeah, so. <laughs> Copyright. Can't be having that, but yeah, I'm uh probably install the media mod piece right here, and then tomorrow I'll just finish up and put in the new screen and take out this old screen. This screen will be for sale, of course, in my fashion, but you know, everything's for sale for the right price. Hit me up if you want the old screen. It has navigation, everything. So just let me know. I'm going to take you guys along the process to put in this media mod. And I'm going to just take out the clips out of this dashboard. And I'll catch you back. Excuse me. I'll catch you guys in a second. So this is the new screen. It's just a little dusty. It's used, of course. Just it down. Um, yeah, this is the new screen. I'm going to install it in the car. And I'm going to take you guys along for the process. See what happens. Um... Hopefully this works. I watched a few videos. It should work on the 16s, the 15s. They need a body control module, flash, or something like that. But um, there's this thing you can get. I'll show you guys how to do it. Um, and I'll just install this in the car and show you guys the finished process. They got the thing out, the dash bezel out. I tried to be very careful with it because I don't want to break anything. I'm not trying to spend any more money on this car. You know, I spent a good a bit. I spent about what, almost eight thousand dollars in the last two weeks on this car. So I think this car is good for now. But um, I'm gonna leave it like this until the screen gets here tomorrow. Let me know if you guys want to see the speedo. It's a little dark because obviously there's no light. But here is my piece i'm going to swap it out and uh take you guys along for the ride i'll catch you guys in a second all right so this was a pain to say the least oh my goodness this well hold on, let me turn back on the lights i took out all the screws so i could take it out i ended up watching um speedy's garage on youtube um i just pretty much yanked on it and i'm gonna show you guys what i had to do in the back
in the back. Just had to take out all of this right here. Let me get my phone with the light. As you can see, I'm gonna try to plug all this stuff back in. And I'm gonna get back to you guys in a sec. So there you guys go. It's all put in, swapped out. I'm just gonna button everything back up. This was longer than I expected it to be, that's for sure. This was supposed to be a 10, 15 minute job. This turned out to be about an hour job. So, but I did it. Feels good when you do it yourself. So I ain't tripping. And the finished results, which I should get tomorrow. As for the screen, should be, uh, I'm gonna love it, but it's all worth it. So catch you guys tomorrow morning. All right, you guys, so the screen is installed. Um, I'm just waiting on the anti-theft code from the people that I bought it from. Um, I'm missing a screw, but I'm gonna drop the link to the for the screw so you guys can purchase that. Me personally, I'm probably just gonna go to a hardware store and get a extra screw or whatever. And then just call it a day, but. For any of you guys that lose it, I'll drop the link. Like, so far, so good. It's looking really good. I'm super hyped for this. I always wanted this in my car. Obviously, gotta get this car cleaned up. I gotta take it to the shop tomorrow to get the springs done.